Those managing the Dallas Police and Fire Pension Fund say that the city of Dallas owes the fund more than $2 million. The dispute over who should pay for pension contributions for police officers and firefighters when they go on military leave. New at 5 o'clock, Jack Fink, live in Dallas to give us a little better explanation. Jack? Well, Doug, the city of Dallas and the police and fire pension fund are pointing fingers at each other, yet representatives of both sides say they want to get this resolved quickly. For 22 years, the Dallas Police and Fire Pension Fund says it's been contributing to the pensions of police officers and firefighters who go on military leave. While police and firefighters have been compensated, the fund says it's the city of Dallas that should have made the contributions and owes the fund $2 million since 1995. Even though the members are not harmed, indirectly they are harmed because their pension system is having to flow the cities. Federal law says it's up to the employer to pay the pension benefit plan. The pension fund says it realized the mistake in 2015, 20 years later, and brought it to the city's attention. Why did it take 20 years? Like I said, well, it's it, when you have money flowing in and you have, and uh, times are good, and the grass is green, you're not, you don't necessarily worry about some of the little things. The fund just had to be rescued for fear it would run out of money within 10 years. Both the city and police and firefighters will soon be paying more into the fund. In a statement, the city says, quote, the city has made all of its contributions to the pension system on time, in full, and as required by the law. It is up to the pension system, not the city, to pay pension benefits. There are no funds due the pension system from the city under USERRA. Dallas Councilman Scott Griggs, who's also a pension fund board member, says discrepancies like this frequently come up. If the city's responsible, the city should pay uh, right away whatever portion the city's responsible for. If the pension system is responsible for some portion of it, then they shouldn't demand payment from the city. Councilman Griggs points out that the city contributes $110 million to the pension fund every year. Both he and other council members and board members say they want to avoid a lawsuit. Live in Dallas, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.